Hey, good morning. This camera is kind of easier than holding up my phone, so I'm going to try to use it when I can. Anyway, um, I, don't know, I think I've uh, stalled out. I'm thinking about doing an Apple Day today. I'm still at 219.8, which is where I was on the 16th. 15th I was 220.8 then I stayed the same dropped 0.2 went up a pound went back down and uh, so here I am so anyway uh, I don't know I got this crazy toothache going though it started feeling sensitive to cold on Saturday and I was like I knew this is what happens every time feels cold when I'm when I'm it hurts when I drink something cold then the next day it just hurts no matter what and then by the third day it's starting to really hurt so I'm going to call my dentist this morning it's not even 6 a.m. yet here in Las Vegas um, but uh, so I'm going to call see hopefully he's not out of town every time I get a toothache it seems like it's a holiday Fourth of July, Memorial Weekend, Thanksgiving, and usually I have plane tickets to go out of town. So, so at least I don't have that going on this year. But uh, anyway, uh, so we'll see how that works. I don't want to do an Apple Day because usually we start out with antibiotics, and you gotta take two the first day and or the first dosage, and. I don't know. I just think I'd be better off with regular food in my system. So, and I was reading about the apple diet, apple day, and it says it's for psychological reasons. I, and I'm assuming that means so you don't lose all hope and motivation, and you'll lose two pounds real quick in one day, and then be all happy again. And if you just stick with the protocol, it'll happen on its own anyway. That was my interpretation. I just read it right out of the pounds and inches this morning. So, plus, it says to only drink water if you do that, and as little as possible. And I need some coffee this morning. So there you go. And tomorrow is my skip injection day. So it says not to do it on one of your skip injection days. So if if it stays stalled longer and longer then I might think about it and Jibby you were right <laughs> she said to stop because I used to be about this weight about 220 pounds for a long time so she, she said I should stop uh, this round and, and then because I was at a set weight and then just maintain and then start over again but I just wanted to keep going so Anyway, it it doesn't matter. It's all I'm I'm keeping on going to teach myself uh, not to pig out every night. So that you know, if I lose some more weight while I'm doing that, then that's great. Um, but if I don't, I'll be happy with what I've already dropped, which is 22 pounds. Um, and if I just don't put that back on, that'd be awesome in itself. So, but I'm sure the the weight loss is going to pick up again anyway. So, and I'm going to change a couple things that I eat. Um, I eat two apples a day now because I don't know. I'm like always kind of on the little bit hungry side, and it seems like way more food. <laughs> Then a little handful of strawberries or a half a grapefruit, but you know I was looking at the calories, and it's like double. So I'm eating like huge apples, and they got to be at least 110 calories. And uh, so like six or eight little strawberries is uh, is like 50 or something. So that will do it. And then I've been eating. Uh, I haven't been mixing vegetables, but I've been eating between 150 and 200 grams of cut up whatever asparagus cucumber tomato cabbage so I'm gonna cut that back to I'm 
I'm going to try to cut it back to 100 grams. So, because I think I've been coming in at a, like 530, 540 calories, and I do eat the the Melba, I, I cut that out for a couple days. I had, my girlfriend found a box of Grissini's at uh, Big Lots, and she got me it. So I had my first Grissini this weekend, and that was kind of cool. Not as cool as Cartman pajamas, but hey, you know, you gotta start somewhere. Um, <laughs> all right, I think I talk longer when I'm sitting down, so I better just, uh, I don't know, this thing doesn't have a timer on it. I barely know what I'm doing with this stuff, so. Um, you guys are all great, and uh, I'll talk more about that a different day. But good luck, everybody. <laughs> Peace out, and wish me luck at the dentist. Oy vey.